So you're supposed to come here and be like, what is this? <laughs> yeah. Agus <laughs> is joking. <laughs> <laughs> this is some Yeti's Coke fridge. <laughs> Oh man, they're um, both they're both fevers. No, I'll let their fevers go away. So, while we're here, let's go check out the town because like every time you get a needle, the town changes. Really? Yeah. Oh, more people leave, right? Yeah, absolutely. I think. Color. Oh, different. Oh, that was a nice color. Bland, you have another son. So hello, everybody who's here. We are beta testing the latest patch. Patch. Yes. Whopin! <laughs> oh man. I might be willing to stream. <gasps> we can stream Shenmue? I'm willing to, maybe, because I've never played it. <laughs> and I don't understand anything. But it seems like it's mostly mini games like. like Pachinko or Plinko or whatever. That's the second game. And then uh, you got your forklifts. That's the first one, yeah. And your That's capsule your toys. Job. Yeah. Alright, so actually, yeah, let's go check real quick. What's in there? Yesterday, or the other day, I told you it was drugs. Oh, yeah. That's why I can't show you. Okay, I think there might be fewer people. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure. Hi, Froggy Car. So there's one less. Third person yeah. There? I want to go to my house. This is my house? <laughs> yeah. Do you have a big beard? Actually, I do. You do. Yeah. I need to fix that. You need to fix what? My beard. Oh. Shenmue! I bet you can make so many puns out of that. Shenmue? Yeah. All kinds of like cow puns. <laughs> I never considered it before. I think she. Yeah, so the club closed down. So. Oh, she's one of the waitresses? Oh, yeah. <laughs> some, some people didn't get that and they thought it was a typo sticks. Yeah, like maybe this place stinks. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I think the store might have... No, I don't know. This always remind me of Jamie. This guy. <laughs> Jamie, though... Forever? Even a long time ago? Yeah, back then. Oh. I wonder why. He did kind of have that hair at one point. Uh, actually, let's go check the Etoy development room. Okay. Uh, these guys, where's up with them? Okay. <laughs> Etoy development room. Do you think room. we would stream real. Uh, uh oh. Aww. 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 Like a, on a real Dreamcast? Yeah, I would like to. Okay. If possible. We gotta but we gotta a, get one that works. We gotta get a Dreamcast and we gotta get a Shenmue. Because I don't really trust uh, emulation for higher I've end systems. I've seen the emulations for Shenmue. It's yeah. bad. Yeah, it's kind of hilariously bad. <laughs> Where you can just see his eyeballs walking around. Yeah, <laughs> floating eyeballs. So this guy in chapter 5 or chapter 4, he says like he sprinkles water in the room because the air is so dry or something. Mm hmm. Is that a thing you can do in hotels or something? Sprinkle water on the on the carpet? That sounds that like help? a bad idea. Yeah. I've never heard of it, so it seems like one of those weird Japanese you know, life tips. You know, like, I know you don't watch Johnny Kate Plus 8, but, like, she's such a clean freak, the mom. Yeah. And when they go to a hotel... E.B. Marcus is in here? Is he? Yeah. Is that you? Which E.B.? Marcus Limbo? My or are you a, a facade? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, well, the hotel stuff doesn't matter now. I need to. I need to. Shen Yu. What jokes are we making okay, here? Okay, so uh, earlier in chapter five, she has McDonald's on her head. Look. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Um, earlier, like in chapter four or five, like there was a kind of a mix-up, and it seemed like both of her and Fuel like <gasps> each other. Hey. But then, like, if you come back and read it now. It's Marcus Limbaugh. Oh, think. sweet. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> How's it going? Did not expect you. <laughs> Hello everybody, Marcus Limblom here. Actually, I'm not Marcus Limblom, but... But he's in the chat. <laughs> now I'm nervous. Okay. I'm talking about Shenmue. <laughs> so the Earthbound Localizer is in the chat. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> okay. So we're playing Mother 3. 
I was actually hoping uh, Marcus would want to do something like this someday. Like, he could sit down and play Earthbound and just talk about it this way. Like, we sort of did it um, during the Earthbound Bash, but, like, we switched turns with everybody so much. Yeah, Marcus didn't get enough time to yeah. talk. Well, I'm gonna tweet about this. <laughs> Marcus, stay in here. <laughs> We're about to end in, like, 20 minutes, too. Oh, no! Yeah, like everybody changes the text so often. Like now everybody's saying new stuff and I kind of want to check it all out, but I also want to keep going. Man, even he's changed. <laughs> Everyone say hi to Marcus. People are flipping out. Yeah, we were talking the other day, like we were looking at some stuff in this game and I was like, yep, I just took that from Marcus. <laughs> Like, uh, what was it, later days? Yeah, also like Dakota, stuff like Dakota. that. Dakota. Um, right now we are... Oh, so he's taking a break from game development. Oh. Right now we're in Chapter 7 of Mother 3 and... About halfway, about two... I don't know, maybe about How halfway. How many needles were pulled? Three needles? Uh, I can't remember. We still got a couple more to go. Yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna say like two fifths of the way through. Okay. If you want, if you want an odd fraction, forty percent maybe. Marcus said you did a great job. Oh, have you played it? Have you played through it yet? Yeah. Have you played the game at all? Like I, I'm always wondering. Like I wonder if he's played this part. I wonder if he's played this part. Like it's kind of a such a non-earthbound game at first. I was worried that you'd get turned off from it. We think this is a Wii. Like every time, every time I see, it, I get to be like, "That's a Wii." That has to be a Wii. Come on. So uh, I think they packed up and moved to that house. And he's just staring at the happy box, like everybody who is watching Twitch right now. <laughs> he changed his text there. You know what would be funny if like one of them would leave, like that married oh, couple. Oh man, yeah. And like the other one would stay a little bit longer. Um, oh, so he, Marcus did play the beginning for a couple of hours. Yeah, it's a very different game at first. <laughs> like, as you can see, you know, it has earthboundiness to it now. Yeah. It starts out so different, and that's why I was worried you'd get turned off. Like, it's dark, and there's a little harsher language in there and stuff like that, and people not having a happy time. Well, he said he got busy with uh, development work, but he's going to play more soon. Okay, cool. So the spoiler is that Ness is the final boss, and then he turns into Godzilla. Yes! <laughs> so yeah, I hope you do get a chance to try it out sometime. You'll, you'll see like little sparks of your own work in there. I can't remember, I wonder who... I think he asked... he told us this in the... during the bash or something like that. I was wondering who did this, Mr. Saturn Font? Because... Oh, oh! We we kept the font in here. You hid that from me. <laughs> it's not drugs. It's, yeah. But yeah, like we had to do a bunch of extra programming to make the Saturn font work right. Work right. Oh no! Does that open up? Like when you check the letter? Uh, I think you can check it anytime. You could check that at the beginning, right? Well, sometimes it won't let you, but. So when I saw that, I was like, oh, oh my god, oh my god, yeah. Mr. Saturn. That was like our first, like, uh, hint that, whoa, maybe Mr. Saturn's gonna be in this. Oh, there's the Saturn table. <laughs> 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 the jar looks sad. How do you make a sad looking jar? Somebody draw some. Draw a sad jar. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because you're a sad jar. Yeah, it was. I had to really study. Um, oh, their bees look weird. I don't draw them that way. Who you or me? Ben? When I write Boeing on. Oh, anyway. okay, yeah. So, um, on Etoy's site, he had like during Mother One Two's uh, release, every week he would post about like Mr. Saturn language, mm -hmm. Japanese, and he would add, he would like put a post a sentence like, um, it was like a sample sentence in normal Japanese, and then he would invite readers to send in what they think it would be translated into in, Je in Mr. Saturn language. Mm -hmm. And then uh, he, would, he would post all the responses and be like, the real answer is this. <laughs> and then he would, he would sort of give like his reasons for that. 
so I studied up on all that, and then I also, you know, went through the whole Earthbound text of Mr. Saturn and tried to keep with that. And I tried to keep the boings and zooms as appropriate, stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Like, a lot of people will just say, like, something goofy, boing, but that's not how he really works. Thanks, thanks. So anyway, I did a lot of work on the Mr. Saturn text. You can be sad again. Here we go. This is so weird. I want one of these in real life. Yeah. Didn't somebody make one? Uh, it wouldn't surprise me, but I want one. <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> Everybody, we got a table. Ah, oh, blocked. Man, we need this. I know. Oh man, when we got married, we should have asked for one. Oh, you know, I thought about going to Home Depot and getting like, I don't know, plywood? Is that what it is? I guess that so. really thin one. Yeah, it won't be and very like, good. And like trying but... to make this table myself, but I would probably get so angry, and I'd probably cut myself with a saw that I would end up in the hospital. So fan gamer needs to sell these. Absolutely. I even brought it. I uh, brought it up one time, but of course they were shot down. What because... if like instead of actual tables, you make like TV trays? Ooh, that would like that. that like everybody would be calls cool. them different things. TV trays or what are they? What is another term for it? Die, die. In the original text from Mother 2, you drank sake during the break. Is did it you? the same here, or did you drink... Wasn't it always coffee? Like a coffee and tea break? Do you mean here in Mother 3? In Mother 2. In Mother 2? Um, I think it was always tea and coffee. I don't think there was ever sake or mm. alcohol. I wouldn't think they would give kids sake in, in a hot spring. <laughs> Uh-oh. So remember he said that his charging was going... He's had, he was going to recharge his thing and there would be no problem and it would be just fine. I didn't, like, obviously is not the case. <laughs> so maybe, uh, we got 15 minutes. I'll yeah. try. I'm gonna go see the mouse, and then I'm gonna go to Sand Valley. Okay. I wanna get on the table and see the mice. Yeah. I think... <laughs> you have a lot of free time to be talking to me. <laughs> Let's see. So, so far we haven't found any more bugs. We found two... <laughs> that sound, well, how is that making that sound? So we found two bugs so far while testing this patch, and we fixed both of them. And there haven't been any more that I, don't, that I know of. Oh, so maybe it was soda in the hot springs? Marcus, do you remember? <laughs> I, I, I don't remember any of that, so... Like, I, I write about it on local Legends of Localization. Is the mouse the one that had the family down here? Yeah, I'm just gonna go with that. I'm taking the long way just because it's easier to get to. Man, I remember when these guys were annoying. Now I can just table them. <laughs> Rocket go. There he is. There's the squeaks. The squeaks and the mama squeaks. mouse. Squeaks. Oh man. He missed that. Aww. That, that really felt like a Marcus y thing, maybe. There. Okay. How do you know that word? Mice? He did! It's the squeak. squeaks! <laughs> That hip chick magnet you met by the pond earlier. But now I'm a stay at home daddy -o. Yeah, I really That's liked, really well written. Yeah, I really liked how I came up with that. <laughs> <laughs> like I was writing it and daddy, daddy o was like perfect. Yeah. That sounds like something Jeff's dad would say. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, maybe I was channeling him. <laughs> yeah, I want him to play Mother 3. Like, he'll, he'll probably have the same reaction at first. It's like, not, it's not earthbound, but. So Marcus says about the sake, he said, I don't remember either. I don't think there was a reference to sake in Earthbound though. I would have taken it out. Yeah, I don't think <laughs> I don't think it was in there either. They would have had to take it out anyway, like whether anybody wanted to or not. Oh mm -hmm. I was talking about this earlier. Oh, the line, got the line changes throughout the chapter two, I think. And now it's almost empty. <laughs> oh well no, it was a bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> that kinda sucks. <laughs> Is there someone in there? 
<laughs> oh man. It's almost like Itoy read her mind, like what we would think. Someone fell asleep in there. I so thought... there's a cow in the girls' bathroom? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, something's up. <laughs> She looks like the lady who's looking for work. Hey, yeah. wait, they're the twins. Yeah, so definitely, I'm really, really glad Marcus showed up. It's great. <laughs> We're just like, we stream every once in a while after dinner to get this done. Kind of don't expect a big deal or anything. Yeah, Marcus, feel free to hang out whenever you need to, like, yeah. Uh, Take a break, yeah. Bring your game? Do you want to, like, talk about your game a little bit that you're working on? Okay. <laughs> so, someone asked Marcus about the Majipsies. And uh -oh. he said, uh, Marcus said, Majipsies, hey Mado, tell me about them. <laughs> oh yeah, you haven't gotten there yet. <laughs> yeah. It's in chapter, it starts in chapter one, um, like the second half of chapter one, and it's almost like a thing that Nintendo would definitely have to change, and yeah. it's kind of like everyone's number one question. I kind of want it to be a surprise, like Marcus, you'll meet the Majipsies soon if you keep playing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you, need, you should play and then... Uh, oh man, I want to film your reaction. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't play it! Until we can get up there with the camera. <laughs> no, I don't know. Play it, cause it's. I like that. This guy. He's oh. A jerk. What was inside them? Tons of awesome stuff. Did we get anything? <laughs> yeah, we got the we got the sweater, but like if you check them all, they'll all be the sweater. Oh. And then like you can't open any others. So he's lying. Okay, it's time to go. So I pointed out like there was a hidden Earthbound reference here to the mouse with the sixth sense. Mm -hmm. Actually, if we come here, there is a thing we can do right here. So You're what stuck? I'm, oh. I'm going to do is... I think there's something we could do here. Yep. Ew. You can get stuff That'll like that. That'll turn into yogurt. Oh, the Claire. <laughs> like you can, check, you can check the trash. You got one money. I never would have thought to check that if I hadn't seen the script. Yep. One money. Isn't the Kingdom Hearts they're called money like that, but with M U N N Y or something? I didn't actually. I mean, that sounds like uh, something else. Oh. It could be. I don't That's know. another game I really need to get into. I played a few hours of Kingdom Hearts, but yeah, I, can't. I even worked on the second game in a little bit. But <laughs> Jessica was telling me about how she got her copy of Birth by Sleep back again, and I was like, "Explain to me the title." There's so many. What like, does that mean? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so in Japanese, there was something like this too, like Ooh. like were different versions of one word. So mm -hmm. to do that, I did um, some rhyme, rhyming like this. I wish I like I'm always saying like I don't remember what this was in Japanese. So Marcus is saying um, he's going to be doing a Kickstarter finally starting next week. Nice. And he's going to be doing some stuff about Earthbound and his playthrough of Mother Three in the updates of the oh, Kickstarter. Crap. Oh no! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So Marcus, yeah, he's kickstarting a game that he and his team have been working on for a couple of years. Um, there's, a, didn't you make a Twitter for it recently? You can post that in the chat so that people can follow yeah. it. I can post it real quick on the stream too, maybe. Okay. We are sad or oh, oh, that's right. Remember one of the very first pictures that we got was this place. So one of the very first Mother 3 screenshots we ever got was like Lucas standing like right here. Really? I yeah. don't remember that one. Yeah, it's one of the very first ones we got. And we didn't know what to make of it, but it actually like it turns out, you know, has significance because just down here What what? Is Oh no. Is death. <laughs> These are earthbound enemies. <laughs> Is is it is it is it? Is it <gasps> Dakota! Everybody say Dakota. <laughs> Watching Watch the ceiling. The ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make up a Mr. Saturn voice, and it's gonna change throughout the playthrough. So tell me which one you like the most. <clears throat> Watching ceiling. That one's okay. Oh, okay. 
Oh, I thought you were going to do some more? No, that, you okay. know, I'm going to read their voices. Watching ceiling. <laughs> I've never made that voice before. I didn't know I could make that voice. Wow. <laughs> Watching ceiling. That's pretty good. It's going to be, it's, it's kind of urkly. Oh, man. So that's Sonic like? Yeah. Oh, snap. Here we are. So basically, Mark is tuned in at the most surprising part yeah. of Mother 3. This is a, like a big surprise, like Saturn Valley is in this game. Yeah, because it's like the whole game had barely anything to do with Earthbound. Yeah. Here's Saturn Valley. Yeah, so it's a... So actually, here's a little a little thing in Japanese. It's um, not called Saturn Valley as you would call it normally. It's like Doseisan Dani, I think. Dani? Which is like the Japanese version like of Saturn and Valley. Like oh. Saturn and Valley. Mm -hmm. In this game, it uses the English word, so... Really? Yeah. Like, it uses Saturn Valley written out. Yeah, in Katakana. Huh. So, it's, there's a slight difference, but you can't really convey that in the translation. Hmm. What's the significance of that? Is there I guess, any I guess, I guess you could say that it's the same name, or it's like... Um, they translate to the same, but they have different names, so they, that's why this one's different. Mm -hmm. They're like two separate things with the same similar name, I guess. Hmm. So it's like not THE Saturn Valley. It's this one. There, yeah, there's like different ones, I guess. Okay. So I guess um, if that didn't make sense, someday it will when I do it on Legends of Localization. Because okay. <laughs> uh, it involves different writing systems and Japanese using English and stuff. Okay. I like how the, even he's confused. All these people are confused by this place. <laughs> yeah, even he's, he's saying boing. <laughs> boing. Oh, they say yeah, man, this uh, it just farted at me. <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, so this game. Marcus asked, uh, "Hey, Miro, Dakota was Gunma in the Japanese yes. version, right? Yeah. Yeah. And then um, they said Dakota earlier in this game, uh -huh. right? Yeah. And so, it was Gunma in this. Yeah. Too. I, I've um, explained all that live in the notes, so yeah, everybody well, everybody just... knows. No, I'm saying just that, like <laughs> I explained for Marcus. Okay. I explained his thought okay, process. Okay, here I go, I go. This hole! To a cliff in Fire Mountain! <laughs> you sound like a strange Native American. So I really like how even there's bows on the sign. Yeah. They didn't have that in Earthbound. But, there's... uh... I always liked how they were on the houses. Ooh. Well... Uh, BB Gang Zombie Rose. <laughs> There's the sad jar that he drew. You wanna tweet it at me? Okay. I'll, I'll do it at the end. <sighs> tweet it at Earthbound Circle? Um, yeah, it'll work. Yeah. I'll do it after we're done. Like, what, I, what I'll probably do is, um, won't do too much around here. No, I don't wanna leave Saturn though. Like, no, I mean, the we're. hard part coming up, right? Yeah, so this is a famous line people really oh, like. Oh yeah, only five can ladder. Yeah, you'll see later what that means. I don't have the Haramaki with only five can ladder. I have the red one. Cup of life. Is noodles. it the first time we saw them in this yep, game? I think so. Now, why is the Mr. Saturn hot spring pink? I don't know. This is no, it is in Mother Two also. I know, but I didn't like understand why. It's um. It always look like it's, cotton candy. It's, yeah, no, it's a strawberry milk. Oh, a strawberry milk. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to ask Etoy. That's that's Mr. Saturn Alder Skin Flakes. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting back. out of this valley. <laughs> I'm taking it back. Jeff, man, you could climb this. <gasps> we need to get Duster. Yeah. We get him in a bit. Watch. Like, <laughs> so Mark is like the line of wash the puke off your body. <laughs> that's usually a good thing to do. It's covered. That's what's in there. It's just puke. Ew. Okay, so do you want me to do the, the bots? Do you want me to get Duster first and then save it? Or do you want to just end it now? Oh, let's go ahead and get Duster. Okay. Is he hard? Is it long? What do you have to do? Oh, we just have to fight a bunch of these guys. Yeah, let's fight these guys. All right. Did you save recently? Nope. Uh-oh. So this phrase that's used in, in Japanese, uh, apparently it actually is a special phrase that Itoi uses in all, all three games, actually. Really? We think stinking? Yeah, I, well, what, I forget what it was, but uh, 
I didn't realize he used it in all three games until I started like working on the Mother 1-2 translation. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh crap. So I have this phrase used in my Mother 1-2 translation also. Um, and I forget where it was in Mother 2, but uh, it's somewhere in there. You know, more things than ever have little bows. I bet Jessica would really like Sally Valley. <laughs> Has she never played Earthbound? Um, probably not. She just likes Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> So they're torture, they're trying to get information from these Mr. Saturns, and they're torturing them by telling them scary stories. <laughs> <laughs> I like doing the fight bot text, it's funny. None, Mr. Saturns! Uh oh, do the fight pig mask too? I think so. Okay, fight bot. Should I do this? What are you doing? I didn't see Trivia, that. trivia card? Yeah, use the trivia card on. Um. Uh oh. Oh, that was cute. Nice. Oh, oh wait, I hope we can. I hope we can respond. So we're we don't know what the trivia card question is, but every character answers it differently. Okay. Fish, Fish and, and chips. chips. I don't remember what the, what the real question is, but this <laughs> seems to be the wrong answer. So. Okay. We'll have to try it with somebody else. Hmm. All right. So for now, we'll just bash, and we'll Reggie, and we'll just destroy. Boom, ching, chilling, scary story. Pick it, Reggie. Reggie moved to a new place, right? Yeah, Reggie is... He's all over the place. Yeah, he's a little... <laughs> He's over there now. <laughs> Reggie um, moved. Kumatora and Lucas are kind of in trouble. Yeah, it's okay. I, well, this guy can't hurt them now, I don't think. Okay. I just like the, like the stories he tells. I want to know what his stories are. So you can do that. And we'll just bash. <laughs> <laughs> I think I do remember somebody writing like a fanfic or... Uh, a forum post of some sample stories. I oh, think cute. they. Pants weddingly. <laughs> I, can't, I remember wondering if like that is, uh, like the proper, grammar for such a thing. <laughs> and then I, I think I was like, ah, whatever. It sounds okay. It sounds like. It sounds like English. I okay. Think, oh, got it. Yeah, they're not too hard. Yay! Thank goodness, I'm smiling! Ding! Look this way! Looking, look, I'm happy! I'm in trouble! No, wait! I'm happy! Save! Zoom, zoom! Thank you, thank you! Yes, zoom! <laughs> I need to work on another voice for Mr. Saturns. So, um. We want to get Duster, right? Yeah, let's get okay. Duster. Um, oh no, another one? Yeah, do we want to fight them all or do you want to just How get many straight are there? There's two more, maybe this might be one and then one more. Okay. I can't remember, there's not too many. Here comes the scary! <laughs> so Marcus's pants weddingly was originally used by Shakespeare. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> So he, he can't hurt you, right? I don't think so. Mm -hmm. I just like to look at his... Blood like, he has, like, he has so many different stories. <laughs> I wonder if they're comparable, like, comparable to, like, Are You Afraid of the Dark stories, which are not scary. Yeah, I wonder. Except for, like, two. Two of them are pretty scary. Like the pool one, I think. The, the Tale of Dead Men's Float. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the Tale of Dead Men's Float is really scary, just because of that image of the, mm -hmm. the ghost in the water. Then there was another really good... The Lonely Ghost. The one yeah, that was, was trapped one. in the walls. Yeah. That was good. I need to get... Good kid shirt. Is that better than the sweater I just bought? Does he even have it on anymore? Um, no, he have, we have a charm on. Oh. Oh, I'm getting that on. Oh, that has the skull. That's like an alternate... Oh. That's an alternate in the Smash Brothers. That's, alternate That's where it's from. 
I just thought that was like trying to make Lucas a badass or something. Mm -hmm. I didn't know it was from the game. Sleep at 11. <laughs> <laughs> That's like my schedule. So I really like how they wish. I like how they yeah. I always like how they put stuff really high. <laughs> <laughs> they'll never get to. So I think Duster is in the far right one. Okay. Yeah, we can do this. Doctor Saturn. What is um? What are those pink boxes? I don't know. Are they happy boxes? No. <laughs> yeah, that's an earthbound we'll quote. We'll stomp you hard. I probably took that from Marcus there. <laughs> don't go to heaven. Is that line in here? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, oh, I didn't even look down there. What do I got? Got stuff I never use. I should probably use. Yeah. If you see any typos in Mr. Saturn text, it's probably on purpose. Yeah. Because they, they're supposed to talk like five year olds or something. At least Etoy in an interview said they're pretty much like kindergartners or something. something. Have you ever heard a story that literally like makes your bones feel cold? I don't think I've ever had that. Um, well, actually, it might have been when I was reading. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it might have been when I was reading it alone um, in my room. Yeah. And I imagined um, that it was underneath my bed, Yikes. and it was reaching its arms up to grab me. That was probably the most bone chilling uh. effect I've ever had in my life. I had to stop reading. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, you never made it all the way through. No, I haven't finished that book yeah. ever. After I graduated, I had nothing to do for months trying to get work, so I wound up reading so many gigantic Stephen King books like that. Mm -hmm. I wish yeah. I had time to read. <laughs> yeah, um, the Japanese Mr. Saturn text was based on his daughter's handwriting. Yeah. Uh, handwriting. That's why I'm curious to know um, who did the, you know, the Earthbound one. Who did? Or, did was I asking about Marcus earlier? Yeah, you were. Like, we wanted to ask, hey, Marcus, <laughs> who designed the Mr. Saturn text in Earthbound? I don't think that was ever revealed. Yeah, so this is strawberry tofu, and then that was changed to yo uh, trout, trout yogurt, yogurt in Earthbound. But there's kind of a reason why we did that, is because, you know, everything has uh, oh, icons. Icon. Yeah. You can't, you can't fake it and say that's trout yogurt, I guess. Oh, God, these farting presents. Yeah. <laughs> I also think the strawberry tofu, like, it comes into play in some some way later. Saved is good. Ding, ding. K.O. <laughs> Give thanks at you. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> okay. What I guess, is this I guess dragonfly he, I guess he thought it looks like a bow tie. Oh, so uh, Final Starman bought Super Amazing Wagon Adventure. Nice. That was uh, one of my ultimate, oh, Duster. ultimate favorite games. It was like a dollar today. It's a little more expensive now. So I think that sound is supposed to be chalkboard scratching sound. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> the game is reading my mind. Strawberry tofu, I've had it. It's not bad. Yeah, we had it with Marcus. Yeah. <laughs> and trout yogurt. Ew, yeah. My, my <laughs> fake trout yogurt. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Rope Snake. Oh, okay. <laughs> so Marcus is going to answer the Mr. Saturn thing during the Kickstarter. Okay. Um, yep. It looks like everything Earthbound related for the Kickstarter will just be free to read. No pledge needed, just for Earthbound fans. Cool. Stuff for Earthbound fans. That's real nice. Oh, did you give his Twitter? Uh, Marcus gave his Twitter. I'll just post a link though. Oh, a time bomb. These are, are no good. Yeah, so it's gonna blow up in a little bit and really hurt. Ooh. Reggie. Oops. Reggie didn't come to visit today. <laughs> um, let's just have uh, some dumplings. They're nice. How many dumplings do we have left? We have a lot. Okay. But a 
time bomb is on Lucas right now, so. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <laughs> you know what? You know what? What's I hit It affected me in that way, because remember that part where the blood comes up out of the oh, sink? Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, that, that movie and then that book was real effective. Yeah. That was definitely probably the scariest book I've ever read and never finished. Oh, no. No! 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 Oh, wait. He has a thing. Wait, heal him, heal him, heal him. Go, 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 Quick, quick. I don't want to use the memento. Quick! No! All right. Well, I guess if it's going to happen, this is a good event. Okay. I think I think Kumator is in trouble. Okay. I was too busy. I think she might have taken mortal damage. All right, we're just all just going to eat like crazy. Oh no, oh no, she's gonna... Oh, she got it. Oh, this... Oh my gosh. Phone. Alright, that made sure. Okay. Now Lucas, we're mad. Lucas needs some help. Yeah, now this is the part of the battle where they're like on the ground, all beat up. Yeah. And then they look up and then the triumphal music starts. And, uh, yeah. Don't got anything there, so we're just gonna have to do some bow wow bash. What's new in patch uh, version 1.2? We've explained it at the bottom of the yeah. video, but mostly it's typo fixes, uh, bug fixes, minor stuff. Yeah, we fixed some mistakes that, or some bugs that were in the original Japanese game as well. Yes, we survived and nope. only had to use one memento. Yeah, I don't like to use those, but yeah, I guess if you have to. I wasn't expecting that to be hard. Yeah, I'm too busy talking about the universe. Do you know we are the universe? Um, yes. Our freight bot. This must be a really weird part to just jump into the game and watch. <laughs> you know what? That looks like mouse ears. Yeah, on that I time. always thought that too. And those <laughs> eyes look kind of like radioactive symbols. I Marcus guess. is lamenting that he wished he could have fixed a few typos in Earthbound. Uh, are yeah. there typos in Earthbound? There are a few, but most people never notice them. Duster. Ooh, funk. Got wrong. We all got crazy names. <laughs> Thank goodness you're alright. Boop, boop, boop. I just want to talk to Rope Snake. He's my best friend. Oh, universe. Unverse. Unverse. Whoops. Missing the eye. Most people don't notice. I never noticed that, honestly, but I've heard people talk about it. Uh, yeah, we'll be ending the stream pretty soon. We just yeah, wanted to get got, Duster. Yeah, we want to get Duster, and then after that we have to head up to the volcano. But we'll do the volcano later, right? Yeah. I like you, Rope Snake. Is he coming with us? We are catched lots. <laughs> we are Mr. Saturn. Yeah, we can talk to them all later. Let's... There are some things I want to think I forgot. But have you forgotten me? There's the rope snake. You know what? I want a Spelunky minifigure of the rope snake. Yeah. <laughs> Someone did a really cool uh, review video today, the Spelunky mini. Nice. Very long. It was like, I don't know, 14 minutes. That's a lot for like some figures. <laughs> he like he opened each one and was surprised. Nice. It was okay. like really cute. So he waited until he got them. Okay, so I guess we'll end it here. Did you have? There's that picture we were gonna do. Oh yeah, I sent you a picture of the sad jar. By... Man, we're already 21 hours into the game. Like a lot of people can beat the game in less than 20 hours. So <laughs> we're really taking our time here. We got. <laughs> I'm, I'm a, I've been estimating 30 hours the entire time, but we might even go over that. I think we will. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. So at least we're getting some good uh, testing in, and we got a lot of stuff done today. Really? Went to a couple places. Um, we we pulled two needles? No, we, we pulled one needle and someone else pulled yeah, a another a mystery. needle. A mystery person pulled the other one. 
Now we're in Saturn Valley, and we got... I, t I tweeted that on EB Central, yeah. I forget who drew this picture. I think it was BB Gang Zombie of the Sad Jar. Correct me if I'm wrong. Ooh, get the chat back in there. <laughs> okay. I know. I Hello. wish. I wish there was a Spelunky figurine of the pug. That would be the best. Well, let's see. Well, sad jar. So we asked you to draw a sad jar, because that is a thing that happens in the game. A jar gets sad at you. Good night, Zunar. So there's good night. Okay, that sounds cool, Marcus. Oh. I'm actually my email is so backed up, so that's okay. No big rush or anything. <laughs> <laughs> I have emails from like years ago. I have to still have to answer. Okay, Mr. Sad Jar. Um, let's see. So we went through. We looked at some Chimera stuff. We actually I talked briefly and confusingly. Some new word I just made up <laughs> of uh, the connection between our Mother Three Chimera translation and the official shirt translation. Mm-hmm. And the connection we had there we talked about the squeaks. The squeaks? <laughs> yeah. There's the. We went to the. Oh, yeah. We looked at the, some Earthbound 64 the screenshot. Comparison compared it to. Shots. Yeah. Compared that to what we played in the snowy area. Yeah. Um, it's too bad I didn't find that page before. There's a lot more. Yeah. Sadly, we didn't get to fight the Frosty Bun. The but, Frosty Bun. Yeah. But we got. To, I explained the Tin Yeti to some people who didn't understand the pun at all. So mm -hmm. that's cool. The Hang Tin. Or a 1080? Oh, I never knew that. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Oh. I, I explained the chili dog uh, thing. What else did we do? We did a lot of stuff, so... We we, we almost got killed against the steel mecarilla, yeah. but we, we pulled we it out. We pulled yeah. Um, then we also went around and we noticed that the town changes slightly. And then... Thanks for stopping by, Marcus. Yes, thanks. Good to have you here. That was really crazy and unexpected, yeah. so it was a real honor. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Um, what else did we do? We talked to uh, Mr. Saturn Font. We talked about that a little bit. Then Marcus showed up. Marcus showed up as yeah. we were going to Saturn yeah. Valley. We showed Marcus stuff he'd never seen before. <laughs> Maybe he'll be more interested to play it now that he sees that it's actually earthbound the elements in it. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's right. We I also showed off a an unused text from Mr. or Dr. Ananitz that references Ness and Jeff. Yeah. Indirectly. So... If you've missed any of this stuff, we're going to be archiving it, and I'm going to be putting it on YouTube probably tomorrow morning. Um, and then uh, we got Duster. We talked. We listened to some fright, fright, fright bot stories. Bot stories. Yeah, I just had the a good time. The tale of the laughing in the dark. <laughs> and uh, we also experienced the greatest table of all time. Every table should look like the Mr. Saturn. When table. I'm president, all tables will look like that. Yes. All other tables will be smashed. <laughs> okay, so I think that's it. I don't think we have any more pictures to show or anything. Uh, oh my god, it. wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Well, what, what? I forgot. I gotta do this first. I, I don't know what you're scheming here. What's going on? Um. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Oops. Okay, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> so that'll be there for tomorrow, you guys. Uh, tomorrow, I assume. Actually, tomorrow's Thursday. I might not be able to do it tomorrow. It's a very iffy, but we'll just play it by ear. Mm -hmm. We'll let you know. Follow Mido. Um, he's Clyde Mandolin on Twitter. Yes, and if you can follow us on Twitch if you want to see more of this. We also sometimes stream other weird stuff, and we're going to stream more stuff later on. So. After we finish Mother 3, we're definitely going to be streaming some weird games. I'm hoping to stream the uh, Are You Afraid of the Dark, The Tale of Orpheo's Curse on DOS. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and we're going to, we got all kinds of stuff, so anyway, we won't keep you guys around too long. Yeah, and I know it's pretty late. We usually don't go this long, but we yeah. had a special guest and yeah. we wanted to get Duster. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I think that's it, right? Yep. Um, what's today's sign, sign out? Dakota! Dakota, everybody. Go hug your favorite Dakota. <laughs> Bye. Bye.